Claire's getting us the scoop this morning. She's down at Capital One Arena ahead of this weekend's Monster Jam. Hi, Claire. Good morning, guys. All right. The trucks are not out yet because last night there was a Caps game, so they're currently working on getting everything unloaded from the trucks. The Caps won also. But this morning, I am here with Tony as well as Cody. Cody with Dragon. Tony with Thunder Roris. Okay, we're talking all about safety and wearing safety gear. You guys gave me one of these jackets. It's not quite as cool as your guys' shirts, but tell me, what about these jackets are so important? Well, this is the top to what we call the fire suit. It's, it's made out of a product called Nomex, and it's fire retardant. It's to uh, protect the driver just in, in, the, uh, in the unlikely event that the truck catches on fire. That is a really good uh, thing to have. And tell me, uh, why is safety so important, especially when you're driving these trucks? Absolutely. You know, as big as uh, uh, entertainment motorsport as we are, we are very serious. These trucks are 1,500 horsepower methanol breathing machines. These are top alcohol dragsters with 66-inch tires. This is the real deal. So we have to be safety first. Everything from the fire suit to, I, I wear Nomex underwear myself, tops and bottoms, even the socks, the gloves, the head sock, it all plays a factor in uh, how comfortable you are in the truck to be uh, that much more intact with the truck to put on a great performance. Always safety first. All right, so we've got some of your gear here, of course. Tell me, what are some of the things that go into what you put on? Well, every, everything is fire retardant, okay? You've got your gloves, uh, they're fire retardant. Your hood that goes underneath your helmet, uh, the pants, the top, uh, a lot of drivers, they like to use a one-piece suit. It's, it's, uh -huh. it's like your kid's uh, one-piece uh, pajamas, mm -hmm. you know, without the footies. Uh, then you got the shoes are fire retardant also. The helmet is all carbon fiber, and on the inside, is uh, the padding is fire retardant. And then you have what we call the Hans device. It's the head and neck restraint system. It's made by a company called Simp uh, Simpson, and that goes around your neck, and the, seat, and the shoulder harness actually goes over the Hans device, and the Hans device clips into your helmet and actually holds your head back so, you're, so you can't snap your head f forward. I, so I wanted to try this thing on. So it goes around like this. So then, yeah, so you, you don't go back, and we, you put the helmet on like this. This is a better example of it. But, yeah, it, because this is so important, I think a lot of people think, oh, this is just all fun and games. This is really serious stuff. Also, tell me about all these cords, and there's microphones in there. Absolutely. You know, we're in tech uh, with radio communication with our crew guys, uh, giving feedback to him or her or him giving feedback to us uh, if there's something wrong with the truck or, you know, Helping with, with the event flow as far as when we may be coming to the line next or what's to come, maybe a, a change in the lineup. But as far as the Hans device, that is the absolute most game-changing thing in probably the past 15 years of monster truck industry itself. Without this, we cannot do the stunts we because do. Because it, it helps you from not snapping your neck forward and also backwards as well. That's correct. Yes, this thing makes your head not be able to move whatsoever. Even with our containment seats, the only movement we have is our peripheral vision. Amazing. All right. Quickly, tell me what's your favorite trick you like to do out there? Backflip. Oh, heck yes. What about yours? Wheelies. Oh, man, I wish we could go do it, and I wish you could take me for a ride in it. Maybe I'll have to come le next time, guys. But we're all suited up and coming up. We're going to race some monster trucks. Maybe not the big ones, but some little ones. So make sure and stay tuned. All right, Claire, we're going to keep an eye on it, and we'll be, we'll be watching.